Hello and welcome back to Dark Wood. We're on day 19 and we're going to go... Not sure, actually. I think the next thing to do, because we went and wasted a day showing him stuff. Yes, I remember that now. Uh, I think the thing to do is to go to the Mushroom Glade and see if we can figure out the mystery there, because I don't think there's anything else to do. Let's see if I got it right. Favor for the granny. Look around her cottage and look for any traces. Hmm. Alright, well. I'm gonna keep exploring the cottage then and then see what I find. Um. Yeah. Not been making all that much progress though, which makes me sad. I would like. Mm, that way. I would like to be moving along a little bit quicker, but I guess because I don't really know what I'm doing, it uh, takes a little bit longer. This spider body is now forever my reference. I've actually reloaded the, like, I did not do this capture consecutively either, by the way, so that means that it actually stores things like the bodies, but not the rock positions, right? Because this got moved. Yeah. So the bodies are stored, but not the rocks. Which I think is overall okay. Uh, one second, you may hear a noise. I'm bumping up the uh, volume on my headset because it seems a little bit thin. It might be too loud now, we'll see. But the game itself seemed uh, pretty quiet. It shouldn't affect you, but it helps me to hear everything above my own voice, which is, you know, I think in everyone's interests. Is that it over there? Oh, come on. I think in practice, I don't really have to... Is it you? Is it you that wants to eat the granny? What's this? Nothing. Cool. Ugh. Gross. I think realistically I only would really have to, like, use my, uh, axe real quick on it, and that would actually be enough. Oh right, we actually found out the, um, there's like an eye thing that we can do something with somewhere over here, I think? Seems like what we want, right? This looks different. Is it though? This might not be different. I don't think it's different anymore. Right, there's all these footsteps. Let's follow the footsteps. Because there are the frozen mushroom people, which is alarming, I guess. Don't want to step on that. Also, don't want to fight stupid chomper thing that lives in the water. It's not actually a chomper, is it? Well, actually, no. I have no idea what that thing actually is. Annoying is what it is. Oh my god. Alright. Hold on here. I can, like, I can look at you. That happens. That makes it so I can get in and unblock that go over there, I guess? That seems to be the plan. So... Oh my god, I can't run on this. Ah, just... Oh, wait, what? Was this always actually... I don't know. I got lucky, I guess. I hope I didn't just break something. Anyway. That, that was really loud. Unnecessarily loud. Great! Yes! I will lockpick the crate. That's meh. I don't really enjoy that hole. I guess I was supposed to maybe... Oh, the run around is too long. I don't know. Maybe I did it. Uh, maybe I did good. Probably supposed to actually do something about it, but I don't have any fire, do I? I have the Molotov, I guess, but that just seems like... A really sad use of a Molotov. I didn't remember what I was doing the last time, so this was planned. Uh oh. Alright, let's see this, right? Okay. Oh my god, the reverb! 
<laughs> it just that sound just goes on forever. Is that a thing? That's just pieces of him, I guess. So they're they're actually pretty harmless, I think. I mean, they can't touch you, and you have to let them close or knife them. So knifing, I guess, is still kind of preferred if you don't have to. What are these? I really want to know. Oh. Oh, those are just spores. I thought they were little eyes floating. This is all pretty good shit. Single shot shotgun. What would I give up for that? The meat. The meat's kind of worthless. Let's eat it. Because why not? Why not? Uh. Mm. Mm. I was hoping this would get me in there, but it just got me items. Which isn't super great. I don't. still don't know what she's talking about with reference to the. Mm. At least I have antidote, so I know that if I. Let's, let's antidote so that I can just. screw this crap. Just pop all the mushrooms while I'm here. Annoying mushrooms. Uh, I don't know how it is that I get in and out. I'm going to pop all of them. All of them. Every mushroom I run across. Until that effect goes away, which is soon, unfortunately. What? Why is my health... Was my health still going down? Anyway. I guess the best... Feels like what I should do, but also doesn't. If, I, if that makes sense, I feel like I did the less. This would be where taking one of those would be cool. I guess. Let's just do that. Does each pop take damage? It looks like it's stabilized. Maybe. We're very slowly draining. the effect, but I prefer it to being dead. I want to talk to the Mushroom Granny again, because I still don't quite get it. There's the people around. Am I supposed to be following the footsteps? Because I think I followed the footsteps to get here. Do you have good news for me? Have you gotten rid of those hungry madmen? Please hurry. They want to eat me. Cigarette pack. Oh, hey! Empty pack of cigarettes. Next time, try to bring me a fresh one. <laughs> Will do, Granny. I can tell you like your smokes. You like them fresh. We only have three hours left already. Holy crap! There isn't enough time to do things. Here are these. I can't interact with them. Lock themselves in the basement. No food. there's anywhere else to go in that glade. So I think the most interesting thing is this. Because they're also going away from the, the mushroom glade. I think. Maybe. Any footsteps out here? Maybe over here? Doesn't really look like it. What is this? Quarry. 
This looks interesting. Though we might not get much time here. Bear trap. Truck with quarries in it. here and see what's over there. I see a guy! Are you a human person? Josek? Were you? Breakthrough what? Are you one of us? Am I one of them? Or are these the people from like the underground? What did they find? I wonder. That can't be good. Oh, so this save includes the, uh... The, uh... The, the, the dead sow. Oh, okay, so you know that I, it was me. Sorry. Come on. Bye-bye. Night-night. Didn't mean to have to kill you. Shouldn't have attacked me. Really, really shouldn't have. That was kind of unwarranted. Since I didn't... Uh, Potatoes and the thing. Okay. I'm still heading back now, though. I'm gonna use this thing. No! Damn it! Oh, wait. Oh, I can't use any... Oh, you can't use any skills while you're using a skill. Wonderful! <sighs> I think those are also bound to function keys somewhere. Alright. That way, probably. That's mushroom music, I guess. Kind of sounds like mushrooms, maybe. Sure. Let's say that. Let's say that it does. Oh, the meat gave me more, more running. Yeah. This is really far. So we're somewhere in the junkyard, probably over here, so as long as we keep heading that way, we should be cool. Yep, we really must. Okay, there's the thing. Here's some mushrooms that we've popped. We've just popped a new one. To our detriment. There's our spider corpse. And the chopper corpse. And... Soon... Home, probably. This thing, I think it's just a little bit more this way, right? Yeah, okay, we made it. It's seven. See, it takes an hour and a half of in-game time to get over here. That just seems excessive. 740 is when I'm gonna get over there, so. Ooh, I can make a new block pick. Do it. Oh, I already grabbed it, apparently. Uh, that can go... That can go... Not there. Here. And... Yeah, I can't make bandages, but I have a rag. I'm looking at them, like, swapping back and forth between this and the time as quickly as I can. Yeah, okay, everything else goes on me. Good. Come on important this time that I get that. Alright, so I still don't really understand what it is that I gotta do there. Which I think is the first time I've been this confused about what to do in this game. I could be wrong. There's lots of video footage that could probably prove me wrong. It sure feels that way to me. I don't think, I haven't ever felt before this whole, like, 
I have no idea what I should be doing. And everything I try doesn't seem to work. I'm gonna sell that. And the watch. And the pills. Flares, I'm gonna go put away. Because I can. Uh, single shot shotgun. This is not, this is the one that fires one shot. This isn't the one that is useless after one shot. So that's neat. I welcome that. We need more medicines. Because we screwed up. <laughs> mostly. Um, I would rather put, well, I'd rather put the, uh, pills there. But we don't have any pills, so Molotov it is. I feel like I should repair this and then sell it. So that's for sale as well. I intend to maybe have to use that. So there's that. Might as well. Both knives. Yes. This is familiar. Sale. Sale. Things. Sale, sale, sale. Good. Probably, yeah. I think I'm just hearing that thing. Oh, oh no. Just spawned a sleeping one again. Why does it do that? Why does it spawn them asleep? I'm really curious about why that bug is there. Like, I'm curious about what causes it. Can I check how much gas I have? No. It's like, it's too far away, right? Probably. I feel like I should put down that bear trap somewhere, but I don't really know where. What? Wait. You're in here. Uh. to see if it would wake up. I didn't see it until, I guess I hadn't looked in that direction. Weird. That sounds like dogs. Oh, it pushed it in too. It's still out there? No. It doesn't look good. Hmm. I was, I was, um, surprised about the Banshee the last time. I wasn't really expecting it to <laughs> So it does attract them. There you are. There's another one is there now. Okay. Good. Hmm. Ah, alright, well, I don't really get the granny quest. There's the guys outside, I can't do anything about them. There's some footsteps, I don't really know where they go. Um, what else is there? sign, as they say. So there's a roof over here, at least. Just the walls aren't totally there. Hey, buddies. Here you go. How much is two of these? 20? I increase it by 15, so not worth fixing, actually. Uh, or rather, it's... Well, no, selling them... That means that selling them is worth 
five each. So I can basically, well, uh, do you look at the price that I could buy it and then resell it? Because I have some spare, some to spare. But I could only get 95 for all of it. But if I invest all of it, I can get all of that. It's clear cut if I can buy it and make a clear win. It's less so here. I'd rather have the extra ones. Because I need it to repair crap all the time. Uh, I felt like there was something else. Yeah, this, this, this. Good. And I'm just in the. just because I can. I seem to never really run out of, uh, of stuff with you guys, so. Now I'm gonna go and deposit it all over here, where most of it won't get used. Cool. There's more elsewhere, but, uh, yeah, I wonder if that, that's dangerously low. As is, I thought there was something else to do. Oh, do I have? No. Because reasons. Okay. Whatever. I'm just gonna get rid of this. I never make the bottled thing, so not worth rustling over. <sighs> what else can I do with... I can make Molotovs. But I haven't used the one that I have in a long time. The armor's cool, but I don't know if it's really worth it. I'd rather have bandages, honestly. Just more healing. More healing is better. I'm just gonna go dispose of them. I like how they keep if I keep them in here, though. I guess I could repair this. Because I have, I have the resources to spare, basically. There's not really any other reason. Just because I can. Oh, that's why this was down here. This is my repair fund. And this is the other, st this is the, uh, like, stuff I have gathered fund. Space thing. That's fine. What am I going to do with these bottles, then? If I'm, I'm never going to use them to make Molotovs. Well, maybe I would. I'm just going to go sell them. Honestly. It's just, I don't use them. And I, well, like, you can't really buy them from other people either, can you? You can find alcohol. That may have been a bad idea. Whatever, I'm gonna live with it. Here, take them. Take them all, mushroom men. Take them all. Uh, I feel like I need to grab four boards. Good. And then swap this. And I'm gonna go stick that back in there. And then let's come here. You two full. Okay, I am fine with my amount of uh, stuff. Do I have the the thing to make? No, I didn't. I didn't pick up the wooden trunk thing that was there. It's fine because I probably don't need it. I did pick up. Can I sell that to them? Do they take that? Nope. Great. So I have all these useless items that I can't. Well, I guess you can't. You can use them, right? I could. I could craft something with them. They do sell weapon parts, don't they? How much do they? How much do they buy a pistol for? Seventy-five. I guess if I load it up, it's more. I don't know. Because weapon parts are expensive. I don't think they're they're worth. I don't think they basically make make up themselves. Let's see. Because I have the other two the two shotguns here. Only two shotguns you can make. I guess I should go ahead and sell the shingle shot one. Because if I have the double one, I'm not really gonna use it. But it's two hundred and three fifty. So. Which is a shell. Well, they do sell shells. They're expensive. So I'd be able to sell them for 40? <laughs> hmm. And I don't know, because some of this thing's value always seems to be related to the ammunition in it. Which seems a little weird. Kind of. 
but yeah, whatever. Uh, let's sell these at least. Yeah, and all these are like super expensive. So at the very least, oh wait, they have rags again. Wait, do they restock rags every time I talk to them? Do I have no reason to have a rag shortage? No. Where, where'd the rags come from then? I feel like I bought rags from them. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I didn't buy rags from them. I should be buying rags from them, because rags are kinda universally useful. This basically means I can make a bandage every night. I'm gonna go ahead and just, yeah, screw it. Like, no reason to not do that. Take it, take it from me. Cool. And I also want to, what's this? Damn it! Thought already has left my mind. I wanted to see. I wanted to see. Did I pick up a one-shot pistol? What do I do with it? Because we can't do this anymore, and we can't sell leather. Um, until we find weapon parts, we can't really think of using these in any way either. I guess I should move them because they're kind of actually generic parts. You're a special thing of some kind. I still don't completely understand. You're not really generic, but I don't get many of you, so you'll at least occupy that slot in an intelligent way. There we go, and I can't sell those either, nor do anything with them as far as I can tell, so that's very sad. Uh, but, yeah. So if I had... how much is it? Yeah. See, that's the, the question though, is would it sell for... it sold for, what, 200? So you'd get 120 for the weapon parts, and then like 20 for these. So you could get 140 for just the pieces, and you can't sell that. So I guess that's kind of where it makes up its value. But it's worth less than the sum if, you, if I could sell that, if I could find someone to sell that to. It'd be great. It would be great. I am kind of curious now, though, that I, I see that they're, um, mentioning the sow. I literally just put together that, damn it, that the, uh, mushroom lady is probably talking about the guys. This actually makes sense, doesn't it? Damn it. The mushroom lady is talking about the guys in that camp. She's talking about them because they're hungry and they want to eat her, and they're hungry and they want to eat her because I killed their pig. So, yes. Uh, that makes me almost want to actually play through this again, and not kill the pig, and also, I don't know, just see how it plays out differently, if it, how differently it plays out, really. And also not kill the snail. That also, I would like to not do that. That seems like an unkind thing to do to a stranger. But I completely misinterpreted, and it is totally my fault. But, yeah, I don't know. I might, I might record that. I don't know that I'd record myself making the decisions, because honestly there aren't, well, Mm. I guess it's wishy-washy because I never know which decisions actually matter. Clearly Piotrek has something to do, but I don't know if the wreck is, um, like, is this his quote-unquote successful flight? Or, um, because the wolfman killed him? Or is it because, um, or is there an alternative if you, like, don't, don't, uh, do his quest, like you don't make, let him kill himself with his weird fantasies. Why am I here? I don't need to be here. I need to be down here somewhere. Follow the footsteps. So, as far as as far as um, consequences go for actions, uh, this feels pretty good. I will say that much. Like. Even in games like Mass Effect, there's always a, um, or, uh, what's, what's actually a good one? What's a more recent one that's really good at this? Uh, The Walking Dead! Yeah, that's one. Um, that one always really does a good job of making it 
feel like your decisions matter. But I would almost say, like, if you play that game, and you should, you should, it's a really good game. Um, don't play it more than once. Just don't. Because if you do, you kind of see, like, the systems get all exposed, and you see just how little choices, your choices actually matter. Um, but again, it does a really good job, like, it re everything that they do reacts in a way that makes sense. Oh, this again. Why do they do that? Are they marking their territory? Found something in the woods, huh? Yeah, so, so I will say that much. This feels like the game is reacting to my things, even if, you know, in its... I thought I saw someone moving. Even if in it, its totality, it's not really doing very much about it at all. And I think that's fine. Like, in my opinion, that is a perfectly sensible... It's not just a sensible thing to do, but it's actually like a good way to incorporate player decisions. You don't have to change the whole ending to just make it feel... to make me feel like I'm a part of the story. Or so, well... Way to the old quarry. Through there. Well, let's make sure we look everywhere over here first. Why is it so dark? Is it because it's raining? Well, that's eerie. Who are you? I'm not sure either. Oh. I can help you. Try to. Can I get around to you? I think you're just gonna try to kill me with. and you kinda have reason to. Not really, actually, because it's not gonna feed you. But I understand. <laughs> completely. I don't know, can I get. I guess I can't actually. Over there? I could knife him. Maybe go all the way around. Don't know. Oh, good. The rain is gone. Now I might be able to see things. Is there no good solution here? Like, do they all turn into chopper? Or is this just a chopper fest? If, uh... You... Let them live. Okay. I will shine my flashlight at you. It'll be annoying. You sure? I asked. Kindly. Do they not try to kill me if I walk around unarmed? That would be cool if they did that. What is that? It's just a tree. shape here. I appreciate the, uh, there aren't actually that many enemies. I'll take all your clothes, though. Okay, they still attack me. This is totally rage. Like, revenge. Oh, 
want my knife back. I'm gonna keep collecting your pitchforks. <coughs> Come on, you know better. You don't even drop anything. What a waste of flesh. to refine stuff. I definitely want the rags. I think the wood is probably... well, okay, I'm not gonna exchange wood for wood. That's silly. Yeah, I mean, yeah, whatever. No potato. Not super interested in potato. Is that all the clothes? Blobs? Why do these people have all their clothes on the ground all the time? That, like, is that normal in, in Poland for some reason? I don't, I don't get it. Or like in hospitals? That would seem unlikely because that seems less than sanitary. And hospitals typically pay a lot of attention to sanitation for pretty easy to understand reasons. Oh, okay, that's actually a wall of some kind. Tell. Has time stopped? It hasn't. How do we get out of here? Who are you? I like your crate. Hopefully, it contains good things. Not really. You want to do this? Okay. swap one because there's no reason not to but yeah so are these all the people that want to eat her and did I just murder all of them I just killed all the villagers didn't I all the rest are sick and probably will become chompers or something I guess I still don't really know how that sickness works if I'm honest with myself I feel like I do, but that's not really true. At all. No, don't, don't shove it in there. Shove your, shove your wood in the clothes. That sounds like a euphemism. Yeah, you're not in good shape. No threat to anyone. Is this a person? It's a dead person. That's a dying person. That's an empty clothes sack. This is something or another. Mm, and all the footsteps. Do I have time to go back to her and tell her about what I have done? What I have wrought? Don't walk into the fire. Fire bad. I guess the other guy's not really dangerous at all, so he doesn't matter. Alright, I'm gonna just see if I can very quickly run over to Granny Shroom Lady. Sack. Full of rocks. I guess it is a quarry. So that makes sense. And there's the pig. What does the pig do? What does a good pig do? Is that why they don't have to, uh... Do do all the crazy shit I have to do to not die. Pig keeps them safe. Oop, what? I feel like I found Ah No, not the stick one. I'm terrible against those. You can stay over there. Nope. Nope. Something else kill you. I am. I'm leaving. <laughs> I don't even have time to do the things I wanted to do. Is this a bad idea? 
Possibly. Let's do this. Oh, good. Hold on one sec. Run. That really needs to last longer. That is not enough time to make any kind of useful difference. What is what is the intended design goal of that thing then? That's what I don't understand. Like if it can't help me run back home, what is it for? I feel like yeah. We're close. We're doing well, this is a different one. I don't know what this is. Is this the same one? It's a different one. I haven't seen that one before. Or maybe I have. I think I remember that one. A bunch of mushrooms and stuff. Alright, here we go. Maybe? Nope. Are we gonna die again? Possibly. Quite possibly. Friggin. Can I? Nope. We're gonna die. No. I can't see anything. I don't know where home is. Damn it. Swamp area. Oh yeah, great. I how are there more of you? That's my question. I don't even know where I am. Oh good. I am further from home than I need to be. I might still make it. Oh good. Oh, we might make it, make it after all. Where am I? Oh. Alright. Three things. We made it. So we're not gonna die. At least not immediately. Oh, you fuckers! No! Stay away. I don't care for you. No. Not letting go. I know where you are. Actually. Maybe I should stop. Okay. Cool. And I think there's another one. Ah, well, we're not dead. So that's good. Kind of. Ah! Why? Why? Where are you going? The corner. Hmm. I feel like I should hold on to this. There we go. That's better. Where are you? Are you over here? Yeah, okay, whatever. I'm just not going to really look at you very much. I hear voices. A shadows event? You've got to be kidding me. I... I hope... I hope these work. Cool. I'm just trying to look over my inventory and see what I might have that's useful. Are the Banshees still going during this? seems like it. That is miserable. Like, that's just mean. It, is this just like going in very slowly? Is it this time? That one is it. Okay, good. Let's put this somewhere useful. I think killing banshees is bad, right? And here I was thinking that these were sometimes too unexciting. Yep, 
there's there's something right behind this, but I don't know what it is. I don't know that I want to test the game's collision to find out. Shadows in a long time, too. At the very least, we have this stopgap where if it comes through, we can barricade it. Except we can't because we didn't pick up the planks. I see. There we go. And there we go. Well, I guess, yeah, whatever. Yeah. So we would have been screwed if it had broken through. Great! We got lucky then. One. Good. Good, good, good. <sighs> Alright. Well, hopefully, uh, hopefully we've actually done what we need to do about the, uh, the villagers, because there didn't seem to really be much choice there. I mean, I guess we could murder her, but I don't really have, I don't see why we would do that, basically. I mean, other than being a heartless bastard totally just be heartless bastards, but there wasn't any, like, any other justification. <laughs> There's no justification for it, basically. That's what I'm getting at. Anything to sell to you? Yes. These. Maybe some other ones. That is a lot of rep. No. No. Keep them. Nails? Except. Good. Maybe. We'll, we'll see. It might be good. Don't really need to repair anything. Would like to stash nails. Everything but 15 of them. Which seems easier to do in the opposite way. Lots of lots of this, which I'm happy about, frankly. I will take it. Gladly take it. Because, holy crap, I have been aching for um, for that. For, what does this get? Rags. Rags. I've been aching for rags the entire game. Clearly, because of how desperately I wanted them. Uh... Okay, so let's do this. Basically, I want to have two of these, and three are stash. And then, yeah, we go from there. Why not? And I'm going to immediately burn all of them on stupid things. Because I can. <laughs> Let's shift all this up, because I think that makes more sense. Like this. Yeah. Uh, da, 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 da. There we go. That's all gonna go away. And yeah, do we need the shovel? Not really. I don't think it's worth it. Like the the hauls we get from the shovels are good, I think, in practice. Like I don't I don't remember seeing thinking of them as bad. Uh, but they're also not worth it as far as I can tell. Can I get at you? Through the wall? Like, yeah. Good. I like not having to go over there. Uh, this, and we're gonna use probably both of them, if I'm not mistaken. Let's 
buy extra gas too. Why not? We are drowning in reputation. exited out of a, a cell transaction uh, and it actually did the cell whereas uh, when I did this just now it didn't do the buy which makes sense I think in my opinion what do I do with the pincers what are they for they weren't part of the upgrade thing were they I don't think they were what do I need to make this? Oh good, I can make one of these. And what's their value again? I don't think it was very high. I don't think it's probably not worth it. I just... These have probably proliferated already. And I don't really want to mess with them anymore, so... Oh, I had some fuel left over. Good. Ah. The timing on that was just, just wrong. Exactly the wrong timing. <laughs> okay, merge that into these two. I don't know, there's enough stuff now that it's getting harder to organize. Uh, kind of group these as overflow, I guess, somewhere. This is all essential, except for this. I don't know that I really need more than, like, three of you anyway, but... If it's overflow, we should just sell it, technically. If it really is overflow, but I don't think it really is. If we can find weapon parts, though, it's definitely worth making one just to sell, I guess. Because I got a lot of things that I could sell. A lot of things. Except leather. Uh, okay. You know, I think I'm just going to accept that the leather is worthless and just like, it's like a backpack over there, right? I just, I just want to put it somewhere. I'm just going to put it on the floor. Because I can't sell it and I can't use it. So, might as well not have it eat up space. That frees up all of that. that we can do... I kind of want to keep the like, planks and nails together makes sense, and I want to do it. Yeah. And then, like, lock picks and this, but I can, I can have enough of these if I really get into it, so I'm going to go ahead and move it down there. And then we have, like, the special fund. And then it's all confused and horrible. Alright. That ain't great. Maybe if we move sort of the miscellaneous stuff up here, because that's that's enough 
for the amount of scrap metal we sometimes get, I think. Um, this is a special thing. And then I think we can use, like, these are also worthless. I'm just not, they shouldn't be here. If I can't use them or sell them, they should not be in here. And then we've got, like, these two things. This is special somehow, because it's worth zero, and yet it seems not like it should be. It should, looks like it wouldn't be worth zero, basically. Yeah. I guess I guess that's about as good as it gets. Like this is all. Uh, but I want to put all the weapon stuff together because it belongs together. This is upgrade, I guess. So I'm just gonna leave that over there. This is special weapons. This is stuff. Yes. Organized-ish, and I'm gonna walk away from it before it drives me crazy. Again, I have eight. 10, 10 extra inventory slots. That's pretty good. That makes me happy. Alright, well, close the door on that. And, oh, should I call it an episode? I think I will, because this is a little bit of cliffhanger, I guess. Because uh, we, we may have accomplished what I needed to do. It looks like, really looks like, oh, I guess that's the, that's the gap with the guy sitting behind it that I can't actually help. At least I don't think I can. I didn't see a way to help him. Could, could murder him, though. I definitely saw a way to murder him. I don't know what that is. That's curious. Oh, that was the, the cottage thing that I found, so I probably will go visit that again. See if I can't find anything there. Um, and then, yeah, I'll head back to the Mushroom Glade, and let's find out if that was what, what the Mushroom Granny wanted me to do. I also like the, before I go, the implication here where, um, the villagers were, uh, looking to eat her, which means that they eat mushrooms as well. So I don't know quite how to... I'm not totally clear on how all that fits together just yet, but it seems like it probably does. Mm, another sip of delicious pear juice. Anyway, I'm going to call it an episode here. As always, thank you for watching, and I'll catch you next time.